What is up YouTube and welcome back to the Minnesota Wild Franchise Mode. And this is actually going to be the last episode. We are going to have this final push. Um, Sim the season. We're going to be winning the President's Trophy for the second year in a row. I feel like I built this team to a contender and a young team and a good prospect pool. And I want to move on to an expansion team because that's the ultimate test. And I'm just excited because I have a team created and I can't wait to use it. But before this season, we made a big trade. I had it filmed or recorded, but I think I deleted it by accident. I forgot what we... Well, here's the team. I think... What did we... I think we actually signed Charlie Coyle back in free agency. Everything else. Pod Colson's been playing... On defense, we'll take a look. See Dumba, Petrangelo, of course. Then we have Brett Burns. Wow, Philip Broberg's up to an 86. I didn't even realize that. He's a beast. So our defense looks pretty stacked. I might actually move Broberg up. So we traded Yandel. Forgot what to forgot what to what team, but we got like a second and like a fourth for him. And then I think we traded like Jonas Brodeen, maybe a couple um, medium top nine prospects, maybe a pick for Brent Burns. So, Burns, of course, has a huge contract. So, I think win or lose the cup, after this season, we're going to go through free agency and just make sure that the Wild are all good to, are all good to go for next season because we're going to have to sign, I think, Kaprasov. So, we're just gonna we're gonna go right in the playoffs because I want to see how deep we go. As Kaprasov had a sick season, and I think he's gonna be S for seven million. So we might have to move Brent Burns out. So we won the President's Trophy yet again. Hopefully we get out of the first round, as we are playing the Los Angeles Kings first. So we're gonna hop right into it. I don't really play any games this um this um franchise, but I want to actually I want to move on to a, a expansion team. So first period sim. Boom, who scored? Jason Zucker, 1-0. Killing the shot, second period. 2 nothing. Pot Coles in the rookie. And, oh, I didn't mean to skip it like that. But Matthew Boldy, who got drafted by the Canes, scored. And Jack Hughes seals it up. I didn't mean to uh, skip the period. I meant to play it. But we take game one. That's a big game. 3-1, that's a good score. I want to see if we can start dominating. So, game two. We could get both of these. It'd be big. Excuse me. Jonathan Davis on the Kings. First period. And we're on a power play and we scored. Pot Coles and back to back goals. Second period. Oh my goodness. Jack Hughes and Panarin. That top line explodes. Let's play it through. 4 nothing. We have 25 to 17 shots. 10 more shots. They're on a power play. I think the game is. I'm just going to simulate. And that's it. So we take both games at home. Devin Dumnik with a shutout. Jack Hughes with three goals in two games. So let's go. Man, if, if we could win the cup, man, this would be perfect. Like I said, when I lose the last episode, because I want to move on to an expansion team. So first period, game three in Los Angeles. 0-0. Zero, zero. Even though we're almost double the shots. S second period. 1-1, one, one. Jack Hughes and Mark Giordano, man, all these players on the Kings. So, we'll let it run. We still have the hand in shots. Kill off a big power play. Oh, man, we are murdering them in shots. Oh, they have another power play. Oh, Kopitar puts it on the power play. Come on, boys, you can't be taking those penalties. Six-minute mark, five, four. Someone step up. Oh my god. Oh, what is that? I thought I paused it and Jack Hughes tied it, and then a minute later, Ilya Kovalchuk beats Doom Nick and they steal that game. I didn't even realize. I thought I was gonna um, reduce the speed of the sim, but damn, that's rough. So at least we're in it. We definitely killed that. I think we definitely beat, we killed him on the shot, so we, it's just those penalties. So first period, game four. Mark Giordano, back-to-back, -back. second period. All right, we come back. We are yet again killing them on the shots. As Rasmus Kapari gives the Kings, I think they gave him a 2-0 lead, then point Fiala scored for us. 
So third period. Basically doubled the shots yet again. Power play, come on. Whoa, I thought that was us. Oh, we tied it. Anders Janssen. We are murdering them on the shots. Is this is going to go to overtime. Wait. Oh, it's an overtime. 41 to 21 shots. All right. Since it's only game four, we're just going to let it run. 42 shots. Jonathan Quick is balling out. Oh, and Jonathan Taves. We are killing them in the shots. Man. As the Canes steal two games. Damn, that whole Eastern Conference was all almost all sweeps. Look at that. Ah, oh, man, we got to bounce back here. We I think we've been playing awesome. So, first period. No. Second period. All right. Come on. What's the shots? Okay, they're pretty even this time. Giordano has been on a tear. Oh, and there's no... Are we really going to drop three straight games? Power play? Oh, wow. Wow, we dropped three straight games. Going back to Los Angeles with a down 3-2. All closed games except for game two. Uh, and Giordano has been killing us. Okay, 2-1. Greenway and Kaprasov, Boldy scoring. 25 seconds left in the period. Second period. Oof. And they have the upper hand shots. Not by a lot. But it seems like the Kings have been go running with us, man. We've dominated them in the first couple games here. Oh, who the hell is that? Tying the game. Felt really comfortable with a 2-1 lead. Come on. Yeah! Kaprasov again. Gives us a 3-2. Another power play. Okay. It's alright. Let two minutes go by. Three minute mark. And Pot Coles. And he's been big this playoffs. Buries the one to seal the deal. And we're going back to Minnesota for game seven. That was a big win. Come on, boys. Let's, let's, let's get going here. Come on. Let's not drop. If we drop... If we drop this game, I think it's, it's, I would probably be fired in real life. <laughs> I feel like I'm just not, but I mean, I felt like I put the team there. So first period, 2-1, Greenway, that fourth line's been killing it. Greenway, back-to-back -back goals, Pot Coles has been killing it. All right, second period, 4-1, let's go. Same, let's go, let's hold on to it, boys. Let's not choke this. Add another one. Okay, that's fine. Not a power play. Oh, and Kaprasov, he's been big. Five to one. Ends up being six to one, and we move on to the second round after being down three to two. Oh man, that was a close one. Two good, good games back to back. Jack Hughes point a game. Let's advance. I think. Are we going to be playing the Flames, or are we going to be playing either the Blackhawks or Stars? I think. Okay, so we're playing the Stars. Don't know how good they are. Who do we trade for? They do have Roslovic. We traded Roslovic for Honka. I think Honka is probably better overall. Honka is also asking for a lot, too. First period. one nothing. Brent Burns. First goal of the playoffs. Second period. 1-1. One, one, Ty Sagan ties it. Okay, okay. Let's let it run. Even game. Five on three. Oh, why that kill? But they got the shots. Come on, power play. No, not another power play. Oh, man. Come on, someone bury one late. Someone bury one late. All right. We're going to overtime. And they have ten, nine more shots than us. Now ten. Sixteen minute. Come on. Someone's got to step up. Panarin, where have you been? Power play. Oh. Oh, he scored. Kill Ka I, I, oh, That's why I don't like the overtime because they blur it out so you can't receive. But Kaprasov 
wins in overtime in game one. Probably, it seemed like a really hard fought game. So I just want to see, who do we, so it's the Flames and the Ducks. I don't really know, the Flames were always bad. Were bad the first few seasons. First period. one nothing. Sagan, back to back. Okay. We got the upper hand shots. Oh, Jack Hughes just like that ties it. Let's go. Oh, Kaprizov again, back to back. Let's go. Let's shut it down. Shut it down. Petrangelo, he hasn't been. I haven't seen him. Nine minute eight. Oh, Jack Hughes yet again. They've been on a tear, and I simulated, and we take game two. Let's go. Real quick, let's just check out the stats real quick. Jack Hughes is. Oh, that's crap. Oh no, we can't see the playoff stats. Let's not show them for some reason. I don't think you could like. Uh, no, you can't really. Um, Whatever. Don't matter. Why am I in the AHL? Jack Hughes leading the way with seven goals, four assists, and 11 points in nine games played. So, going to Dallas. If we could take a strangle on this series, it would be big. Brain in point, where you at, man? He's never showed up for the playoffs. That's Kaprasov and Sagan, the two guys been killing him. We have almost doubled their shots. 2-1, Kaprasov, he has been killing it. I don't think I made him too overpowered, but playoff performer, oh, Matt Zuccarello. Ties it, okay. Let's try to get one back, Kaprasov, Hughes. Braid a point. Who's on my third line? I don't think I've seen anybody. Johnson, Fiala, any of those guys want to step up? Pod Colson, you want to come up big one more time? And we're going to overtime. For the second sh second time in this series, and we have advantage of shots only by a few. 15 minute mark? Come on. Oh, Jamie Ben beats Dubnik, and they take that one. Alright, that's alright. Let's try to. A hard fall game, at least we're in them. These all games are close, man. We need one of those four goals. One of that game seven first round. We need one of those. So first period. 1-0. Braden point. There you go. Second period. Damn. So is that Sorensen? Yeah. Come on, boys. Yeah, they got the shots on us. But I feel like we have the talent. Someone, Brent Burns, you want to put one in from the point for me, please? Ten minute mark. Kevin Fiala ties it. Let's go. Come on. Let's get another one. Oh, power play, come on. Oh, that would have been awesome. Oh, and Jamie Ben scores with two minutes remaining. Jamie Ben is our kryptonite right now. Ay, ay, ay. Scores the overtime winner now. He scores with a minute 53 remaining. Ah, going back to Minnesota with a 2 2 tie. First period. Tyler Sagan has been on a fucking tear. What the hell? Oh, and they're killing us in the shots. Doesn't really seem like it's a good game from us. Oh, five on three. Jamie, Ben, and Tyler Sagan have been absolutely killing it. Oh, my. Oh, and they shut us out in game five. All right, we've been here before. I don't know if I should change up the lines, maybe. I really don't know. What am I going to do? Where's Panarin? What are you doing, Panarin? Come on, man. Maybe we can move Zucker up. Donato. Yeah, we'll keep them. And then defensively, maybe put Burns up. And then put Honka with uh, Petrangelo. Yeah. Get that Burns and uh, offense going. Switch around. Put, put Fiala back down the third. Jason Zucker moved him up. It's game six. Winner go home. This is for the season. Oof. Second period. 1-1. One, one, oh, Jamie Benn, man. At least Braden Point's getting there. But Jamie Benn and Tyler Sagan have been absolutely killing it. I feel like that's their whole team. Who's been, like, they, I've... Oh, Panarin. I called him out. Oh, no way. Back-to-back? -back? Oh, we could get back-to-back. -back. Come on. Hold on, boys. Hold on. Hold on, boys. Ooh, Panarin, I was like, where the hell were you? He came up big. Come on. Come on. No Tyler Sagan and Jamie Benn. Yes. Oh, man, what a game. Hard-fought game, it seems like. 
and we're going back to Minnesota. New Navarre is a nice time. Come on, man. Just fucking play your role. Going back to Minnesota. Been through this before. Game seven. First period. Let's go. Marcus Unibara. He's playing about ice time. Now I'm going to give you more. Get another one. Oh. Okay, Panarin. He's coming up. And Tyler Sagan. Yet again. I got How many goals does he have? I'm going to have to go back and check. He's been killing it. Come on, boys. Let's get another, let's get another one. Got the shots. Power play. We want to put one in, Kaprasov. Oh, my God. Tyler Sagan has been Absolutely, and Kaprasov puts one in. But Tyler Sagan, can we shut him down? Please, come on. Shut Tyler Sagan and Jimmy Ben down. And we're going to the Western Conference Finals. I have to go back and look at how many goals Tyler Sagan had. He scored, I think, everyone. So I think, so we're playing the Ducks. I think I just saw, so... Maybe, oh, maybe we could see the playoff points through here. No. Maybe through here. Okay, here are the playoffs. I'm gonna go back. Yeah. So here's the so Kaprasov and Hughes, eight seven goals. They've been big. Lindholm's been a lot of assists. He hasn't been scoring any goals though. How many goals does Pat Colson have? He's got four. He was big in that first round. Dumba Burns has four. Okay. Coyle has three assists. Nudevar with a goal and assist. Broberg. Okay. Let me go see. This guy's Sagan. Ten goals. How many goals? I want to see how many goals. He probably like six or seven in that first round. Killed it. I mean, Kaprasov also killed it. But, all right. So, here we go. Game one. And looks like who? Wait, let me check out. Let me look at uh, Anaheim. I want to see who really on their team. Freaking Tyler Sagan, Jamie Ben, holy smokes. Who else did they have? Did they have anyone else? Now they like the same exact team. Jamie Ben, 12 points. 18 points for Sagan. Oh my god. Alright, Anaheim. Let's see what they're all about. Car Raquel's been on a tear. Richie and Perry. It seems like that means that top line. They've been killing it. Alright, so they've been like the exact same team. I don't see no gets left. I'm surprised they made it. But the problem can be 91 overall, John Gibson. 8 and 5. Oof. So, let's see what we got. Do we have an 88 or maybe an 89 overall Dubnik? I think I think we have the, the edge in uh, offense and defense. So, first period. 2-1. Kaprasov and Hughes and ja Jakob Silverberg's second period. 3-2, Kaprasov again, and Raquel. All right, come on. We got eight more shots. Got the lead. Power play. Oh, Kevin Fiala. I didn't know he was in the power play, but gives us the 4-2 lead. Come on. Just hold it on, boys. Can't let Rick. We've only... Yeah, Raquel's only got that. Oh, we are getting the shots. I don't think... I think that's it. That's it. Oh. <laughs> God, why? Why are there top players? I don't think our first line's good at freaking defense. But we take game one. I'll take that. So who's in the... Oh, no. Tampa and Philly. Oof, Tampa. They're probably still the exact same team. Philly might be probably close to good. Because I think Carter Hart's like a 92, maybe. First period. Game two. Okay, who is it? Raquel Daniels Prawn. Game... I mean, period two. All right, come on. Oh, look at the shots. Come on, guys. Look at the shots. We killed off another 5 on 3. Look at the shots. Come on. Gibson, can you chill out for me, please? Gibson. You could relax, man. Gibson, you've got to be kidding me. No way. Oh, a 44 shot shutout. Jonathan Gibson showed up and showed out. Oh, my goodness. That's rough. At least we've been beating them in the shot. I don't want to look at the draft class right now. You gotta be kidding me. At least we've been beating them in the shots the past two games. That's good. First two, so. Out in Anaheim. 3-3. Three, three. Big. So started with, I think, Andre Case, Kaprasov, then Max Jones, Corey Perry, then Brent Burns, and Panarin. 
equal shots, second period. 5-4, Ryan Donato, Henrique, and Burns. This game is insane. Got three more shots. Let's try to get another one real quick. I like those quick ones, come on. I think we desperate, not desperately, but this is a very important game for us. Come on, come on defense. Doomnick, stand strong. And begin the shots. 50 seconds, let's go. Let's go, that's a big win. That's a freaking high scoring game, but that's a big win as we take a 2-1 lead. What's the Tampa series? 2-1 Phillies, Philly won two straight. Let's take a stranglehold on this series. This is crucial. First period, come on. One, two, okay, coil. All right, second period. All right, we got the shots. Three more, not that much. Let's see if we get a quick one here. This is a crucial game, guys. Let's step up. Let's get the next one. Let's get the next one. Come on. Come on, Panarin. Nunavara, somebody step up. Dumba, where the hell have you been at? Ah, another hard fought game. Even game, even shots, and they tie the series back up. Ah, oh, Nunavara is still complaining about the ice time. Yeah, where the hell's Dumba been? I don't know. He hasn't been. He been Burns in the top pairing. I don't think Dumba scored once. So back in Minnesota, first period. Okay, we got the shots. Second period. Oh my God, the goaltenders are showing out, and we have ten more shots. Come on, Mini. Come on, Mini. Let's get one. I mean, we need one. We need. Oh, Richie, fucking Richie, you scumbag. Oh, and they're on the Ah, uh, we always have the upper hand shots. Damn. Fucking Jonathan Gibson is balling, man. Alright. Yet again, we're down 3-2. Can we pull off another two-game... Wow, and Philly's in the cup. Can we pull off another two-game comeback? Oh, Getzloff is playing. Shit. First period. Second period. Oh, man. That's rough. That's definitely rough, and that's probably going to be the series. That's definitely the series. Six to one. They killed us that game. That's rough. Now let's just see if they win. If they win, or if Philly won, maybe Philly was a wagon. Ah, oh, man, our big-time players did not come. Philadelphia, what are they winning? I want to see what they... I want to see what that series was. I don't think I'll be able to now. The Rangers, the, the Rangers have been getting all high picks. I don't understand. Wait, did that... Did that just say Minnesota? I could have swore it said Minnesota from San Jose. Did we just get have a f uh let's see. Let's see what it, Philly won in. Philly won in 7. Damn. Oh, we were so close. Yeah. You know what? Maybe I'll keep this series. I'll just stick it around and I'll just maybe we'll do one more run. Let me just see, did it say I had the sixth pick? Or like a top? No. Okay, that's what I thought. I'm just actually gonna sim the draft. I guess I'm not trying to uh Yeah, I don't know. Do we want to keep this going? Let's just check out the resign. Resign the scouts real quick. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if we want to. Because I definitely want to get the. What's it called going? I'm not even going to sign the AHL guy. I don't know why we need an AHL scout. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, what is our salary looking like? Oh, we have 11 million in cash space? Nice. 
So Kaprasov wants four years at seven million. Seven point yeah, we'll give him that. Hughes is gonna get a contract after that. Um who's expiring? Cap oh oh no 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 no. You know Fiala's gonna want mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Honka's gonna want a good amount. Look at that. He's not even coming off that asking price. Let's just see what our salary looks like after Caprasov because he's our most crucial player. He'll probably he's probably gonna accept. Yeah, okay, he accepted. So we have four point nine. I mean as of right now we're gonna have to pick one person to sign and then um We're gonna pick one person to sign and have the other guy re uh, UFA, and then maybe we could uh, what's it called? But that's it. Yeah, so I think we'll sign Honka. Yeah, we'll give that's not a bad contract, and we'll qualify RFA for uh, Fiala. This guy Shaw. 77 overall. Yeah, so I mean, so hey, we got. I am surprised we had 11 million left over. I'm sure, Honka's gonna accept, accept, accept. Yeah, so Fiala's just gonna chill. We'll take a look at free agency. Like I said, maybe we can move some players. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Oh, this free agency sucks. <laughs> I. Devin Do. Wow, Igor Sesterkin's a free agent. Devin Dumnik needed a new contract, and I didn't give it to him. <laughs> god damn it. Alright, well, let's see if we can move somebody out, because we have no space for it. We have. <laughs> Whoopsies. I don't even know how to move out, to be honest with you. Is this when we just let the... Uh, well, look at Lindholm's freaking trade value now. The only guy we could move out is probably Burns. Yeah, I don't think we'll, we'll probably have to let Fiala go. Let's do we want to move out Nunavara. He's kind of peed off and he kind of sucks now. He's 78. Yeah, we'll move him out. We'll trade him to our nemesis. Give us a second round pick for him. You know, they give us the first. They want to get rid of it. Probably not. Yeah. Like I said... Just get some value for him, second and third for New Navarra, solid D man. Thank you very much. I think we have we definitely have a defenseman somewhere we could stick in or you know, I think this like I said is probably the last episode. We don't even have enough to sign freaking Doomnik. God damn it. <laughs> we gotta trade someone else. Let's just try to get Doomnik signed. Because you definitely need that. I don't think our medium league goalie is ready. Uh, let's see. What is he looking like? Wait, he's paying crap 77. What is he looking like? 85 speed. Not bad shot. No, he's not bad. Wall 74. Yeah, Pollock 70. So, if he's a... Uh, do we have any... Unless we want to trade away Janssen. Trade him to uh, yeah, we get rid of him and then we could bring up Krebs. Can we get a second for him? So we'll trade away Anders Janssen. So now we have plenty of cap. We get bring up Krebs. Maybe some other guys. Now we have plenty. So let's get, or do we want to bring in, no, let's just go with the backbone, because we have a young guy coming up. We'll sign him to two-year 
Wow, Henrik Lundqvist. <laughs> oh my god. Well, they might just... No. The Rangers, what are they doing? Who do they have in net if they have Sesterkin and Lundqvist in the fucking free agency? Georgia, probably? I did give Georgia a medium starter, potential. We could actually probably sign Fiala now. Actually, no, I don't think now we won't be able to. <laughs> we'll just take the compensation if someone offers a... Let's see if he even wants his face wants to sign with us. Oh my god! <laughs> wow, Dumit goes to the Rangers. Well, if Shesterkin's still there, I'll take him. Damn it. You know what? Despite the overall, let's just say he's got a lot left. Henrik Lundqvist. Like I said, this is probably going to be the last... Ah, whatever. It's gonna, this is going to be the last episode. I think I'm going to be... Yeah, I want to get on. I want to move on from this. We had a good run. It was fun. We definitely made a lot more progress than uh, they would ever have. So Henrik Lundqvist is basically a trade from Dubnik for Lundqvist. What a surprise. So... Let's just see how this team was going to look. So, center core. Still have 5 million. Now we could. We'll have Hughes, Point, Donato, Coil still. Left wing, left we'll Kaprasov. Panarin, Krebs, Fiala, we could probably. We'll bring back Fiala now. We have Zucker, Greenway, right wing. We have Lindholm, Pot, Colson, Aberg. And then defense, we'll have Dumba, Broberg, Pietrangelo. Yeah. We have one, two, three, four, five. We're gonna need one more. We could either bring up this guy or Phil Bjornsson can play the young gun. Yeah, so uh, might as well actually just bring back Fiala. Three years, four point seven. Really not a bad contract. It's just that we have a lot of. I would say the only bad contract we have is probably Brent Burns. Other than that, everyone else has a good contract. We'll see if Fiala wants to come back. We do have his rights still. I gave him a call offer, and Fiala comes back. So, Like I said, I think this team is still anxiety for his new team. You were just on this team. Like I said, I think this team is still set for the future. Dumba's on a cheap. I mean, the only problem, the only thing that'll be interesting is re sign Hughes, but. He had 50 goals? What? Broberg, what did he have? Yeah, so like, I think it's a good good young team. I would say that that contract for Petrangelo, I mean, I feel like he's going to drop off. That's a bargain. But yeah, we got everyone signed. Panarin, of course, at 10 million. I think this team is set. And I think this is going to be the last of it. Of the Minnesota Wild franchise. I know I said I was going to go until I won the Stanley Cup. But I want to move on to an expansion, the expansion, expan a expansion franchise. I have a team, the team set, and I want to go into a, a solid rebuild team because I've, I expansion teams are fun, and I actually have a funny, a good, uh, a good team uh, name and whatnot. So after this, um, most I actually probably will start filming the expansion draft after I'm done recording this. So. I'll have this video up rather soon, and the expansion franchise will start, will be, will follow. So, anybody watching, I hope you enjoyed. This was, a, this was a fun one. You know, we definitely built a solid team. But now it's time to move on to a new franchise. I don't know if I should tell you the name. I won't. I'll save it. Move on to a new franchise. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I did. I had a lot of fun moments. The simulations were fun. I know we came up short. Made it to the Western Conference Finals, though. Back to that President's Trophy winning. This team is going to continue to contend. I don't really know how good that Lundqvist will be. But hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you in the next franchise mode, which is will be expansion draft. So peace.